Well, it was really one of the, it was the funnest thing I've ever done, but it was probably one of the most challenging. I mean, it was really extraordinary sort of being in this crossfire between three brilliant and highly opinionated and somewhat cranky guys. <laughs> yeah. I mean, Fats, Not was, Fats accepted, right? No, yeah. Fats, Fats was a guest of honor. and he was, he was never part of the interview process. Okay. And one of the most extraordinary things about the, I think it was three days that we spent together, was just the kindness and the sweetness that each of the other three, and particularly Jerry Lee Lewis and Little Richard showed to its fats, the love and mm. showed to its fats mm. and the extent because fats was having, um, you know, problems with um, dementia or he just yeah. was having problems connected. Let's, let's just say. And yet he was still fats and he was still himself. And to watch Little Richard coax him out of this and get him to sing in this sort of sotto voce voice along with Little Richard, Blueberry Hill, or one of the songs, and just the smile on the face would start, they would talk about cooking, and it was always by Little Richard. And Jerry Lee was the same way. I mean, he showed such respect and such love. You've never seen, I'm sure all of you have seen Jerry Lee many times in many different settings. And my admiration for Jerry Lee has never flagged, despite the many <laughs> scenes and many settings I've observed. <laughs> but but this, was, this was a Jerry Lee Lewis I had never seen before. Three on 